Yo what is going on guys, Flashverse here and welcome back to another video on The Fly Season 8. And for today's video, I'll be covering multiple topics. I'll be explaining the gold boots for the Flash suit and theorize about how Barry could potentially get them. I will also be going over some recent set photos for the Flash Season 8 and this is either from Episode 4 or 5. From what I can tell, it seems to be Episode 5, but I'm not 100% sure. But also, I'll be breaking down some promo images we got released for The Flash Season 8, and it is very exciting. Obviously, from the time I am recording this video, DC Fandom is literally tomorrow. I do want to announce that I will be doing a live stream watch party where we obviously do the same thing which I did for The Flash Season 7 finale, where I essentially live streamed and we watched it together. Kind of like that, and Arrowverse Scenes will be joining me with that. So yeah, you guys could get my live reactions to like the Batman panel, the Fly Season 8 trailer, things like that. So that is very exciting. I do look forward to doing that. And obviously in DC Fandom, we will be getting our first trailer for the Fly Season 8. So I am very excited for that because we should be getting our first look of shots from the Armageddon event. So yeah, be on the lookout for my trailer breakdown after the panel as well. And also, the set photos that I will be going over during this video are coming from Canada Graphs. So huge credit to him, be sure to check out his blog page if you guys want to see some extra shots, which I wouldn't have added on this video. And also if you guys want some details in regards to things like what he saw while they were filming there on set, all of that is on Canada Graphs' blog page, be sure to check it out, I promise you guys you will not regret it because there's heaps of stuff which I wouldn't cover because I want to obviously share some traffic to his blog page so as i said if you guys want to see some extra set photos or if you guys want to see his like like the things he saw while he was there on set be sure to check out his blog page for that for this i'll just be going over the photos which i have and obviously just break them down regarding my theories and also with the promo images they're coming from entertainment weekly and i'll be going over that during the end of this video but first off i will be going over the set photos for the fly season 8 episode 5 so firstly, we do have the shot of Grant Gustin suited up as the Flash. And right off the bat, we do see the new suit upgrade with the gold boots. And um, I have already expressed my opinion about it before. And um, I just think that they look really, really good. I feel like the gold boots just like, you know, really complements the suit. I just really love like the color of gold they used and the material they used. It looks really great. Um, it just feels like it completes the whole suit. You know, it just looks really, really great. And I really love it. It just looks awesome. Obviously, we do get better shots of the gold boots over here than the one I went over in the previous video, but we do see those extra details going on with the gold boots with this shot, and we do see this, like, you know, nice lightning bolt detailing, which is something I really, really like. I just couldn't be any happier with this suit. I think it just looks absolutely perfect. For me, this is officially by far the most comic book accurate live action suit we have ever had. It looks so good, and I'm really happy with the way it turned out. If we do a quick breakdown of the suit, the suit still looks the same. It's still the season 6 and 7 suit, however, we do have the gold boots as the suit upgrade, that's pretty much the only thing. Obviously, they did take their time with the gold boots because they needed to find a way to actually make it work, otherwise it could end up looking really wrong, and that's just because they had to find the right shade of gold to use, they had to find the right material to use, and they had to, like, you know, get the detailing right. And as I said, from what I'm seeing with these more clearer versions of the gold boots, it looks incredible. We do also see that the gold boots are curved from the top and it actually like dips to near like Grant's shin, somewhere like that. And from the backside of the gold boots, it is much taller at the top than it is near Grant's shin. So I do really like the extra effort which they've added in. I can't wait to actually see these gold boots on screen or just like see in the posters and stuff like that because obviously it's going to look better over there than it will from a set photo. Now we do actually see the flash inside this mist and Canada Graphs does mention that we see Barry emerging from the smoke. So I am really interested to see what is actually going on over here. And we do also see that after the clouds are gone, we do see this better shot of Barry as the Flash getting ready to fight Despero. I really love how the gold boots stand out from this shot. It looks really, really cool. We do then have this shot of Grant suited up as the Flash near a map of Central City. 
and I'm guessing this is Grant after all of that smoke scenes happen and this is Grant getting ready to actually confront Despero. It could also be Grant just getting ready to film the scene as well, I'm not entirely sure, but it's related to the Despero confrontation, that's what we know for sure. We do also have the shot of Despero reaching out as he uses his abilities on Barry. I am really interested to see how they will handle Despero on the show or just in the Arrowverse in general because he is actually super OP in the comics from what I have researched because I'm not too familiar with the character but from the comics he does seem like super overpowered. Um, he does still seem to be that level of a threat in the Arrowverse saying that Barry will need the help, need the help of all these other characters from across the Arrowverse to defeat him. So yeah I am very interested to see how they will handle Despero. He doesn't seem to be on his CGI form very often. I don't know why but personally it doesn't really bother me that much and that's mainly just because I'm not too familiar with the character so it might end up bothering a lot of people but personally for me it's not that big of a deal. Tony Curran still looks great with this human form of Despero. Now Canada Graphs does also mention that Despero is mostly on the ground when he's filming and we do also see like Barry emerging from out of a cloud of smoke. I'm guessing that this is the final battle between the two, just judging from what I'm seeing over here. Obviously I could be wrong thinking that, but I'm pretty sure that this is a scene from episode 5. But as we can see from these shots, it does look like Barry has the upper hand, as we do see Despero crumbled onto the ground and he does seem to be losing. So this is probably where Despero is officially defeated by Barry and this is the Armageddon event being wrapped up. Now speaking of the gold boots. How does Barry get them? Because from earlier set photos from this Armageddon event, Barry still had the red boots. So it's not just like, you know, a suit upgrade from season 8 episode 1. He gets them midway into this Armageddon event. So what is going on over here? So if we pay attention to what Eric Wallace said last year in DC Fandom, and I will be paraphrasing over here because I do not have a photographic memory, but he does say something along the lines of, the gold boots are coming, however Barry will not just get them, they have to be earned with a story. So one theory I have is that the gold boots are formed as a result to Barry transforming that new reverse flash suit back to his original suit. So if you guys remember for episode 3 or 4 set photos, we did get the shot of Barry suited up as the reverse flash and one theory I had was that Ia Barton, aka the reverse flash took over Barry's body. Or we could say that the flash is being controlled by the Legion of Doom and due to this the colors of the suit reverse resulting him into being the reverse flash. One of the two, but that would make sense because the new reverse flash suit is literally the season 6 suit of the flash but the colors are just reversed. And if we have a look at this reverse flash suit, the boots are red and it does seem to have the same design of the gold boots because the back of the boots look a lot taller than the front and it does seem to have that like you know curved dip at the top as well. So I'm assuming that these are the same boots. So maybe when Barry is able to regain control over his body, if Ia Barthon actually took over his body or if Barry is just able to come to his senses after being controlled or whatever, the suit reverses back to its normal color and the red boots become gold boots instead because the colors of the suit reverse. That is obviously one possibility that could be going on. Another possibility and obviously this is the more boring option is that Chester just gives it to him, maybe something happens to his red boots, maybe they get destroyed or something like that and Chester just gives him the gold boots like that. Or it could actually end up being some sort of a new power which Barry acquires, it could be some sort of like a speed force construct but he's able to build the gold boots like that. That could obviously be another possibility but whatever it is I'm really interested to see how Barry gets them. But lastly, Entertainment Weekly has some really cool promo images for The Flash Season 8 with Barry confronting Despero and it looks really cool. I do actually know what's going on over here during the specific scene and that is because this was part of a set photo video which I covered from Canada Graphs' blog. So I did do a video breaking down what is going on over here. Obviously for spoilers sake I'm not going to say much over here but if you guys want to know be sure to check out that video. But essentially without giving too much away. It's just Despero reveals his origin story to Barry and it is actually pretty cool. Obviously Barry has the red boots over here and not the gold boots because this is a scene from like episode 2 or 3 but we do actually get a better look at the Despero suit and I do really really like what's going on over here. The suit looks pretty sick. As I said I don't really mind too much if we either see the CGI version of Despero or if we see 
this Tony Karan version of Despero. Regardless, I'm just very excited for this Armageddon event in general. But yeah guys, thanks for watching. If you guys have enjoyed the video, please give a like and subscribe. Be sure to tell me in the comment section down below if you guys are excited for the Fly Season 8. And also, be sure to stick around for my watch party during DC Fandom. I'm very looking forward to seeing all of you over there as well. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video.